Today is, I'm assuming everybody's watching this a few weeks later than when I am, oh, than when I am posting it, um, but today is July 10 and it's a very exciting day because I am leaving to London today and I'm so excited. Um, I'm actually flying out there by myself. It's my first trip without any family without my parents so I'm really excited and I'm really nervous because it's going to be a whole new experience but I'm hoping and hoping so hard that it turns out really well. I'm actually just getting ready and packing the last few things that I need to pack into my backpack and I need to go to the store for a quick run because I need to just get a few more things before I go but it shouldn't be too bad. My flight is at 5.40 it is 10.15. I kind of just woke up and just got out the shower, so I'm still kind of groggy and tired, but <clears throat> uh, we're leaving the house at 1. And I'm all checked in already. I checked in online. So yeah, going. I'm going to London by myself, but I'm also meeting up with 30 different people because I'm traveling through this company called EF College Break. It's my first time, so I have no idea how it'll go, but... I'm hoping, hoping, hoping that it'll be great, so yeah. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, I hope you guys stick along for the rest of the vlogs because I will be not only in London, I will be in Paris. So yeah, stick around and stay tuned because we are going to be doing a lot of fun stuff and I'm excited to show you guys. Alright, um, I'm going to finish packing and I'll see you guys in a bit. Bye, please sit back, relax, and enjoy the service, and we will get you underway. Thank you very much. I made it! Um, so, I am waiting for three more people, but for the most part, I'm here. But we're 
taking a walking tour and then we are going to our welcome mixer to, I think it's a small party. So, yeah, this is Westminster. rioting like gathering here and just rioting uh, they put the big the, they put the fountains there behind you that is what we call Nelson's column because on top of that column we have Admiral Nelson and he was a very important admiral during the Napoleonic Wars again he fought many battles he won all of them uh, he lost the leg and during one of those um, and then in the end he died in uh, one of those uh, battles between the French and the English